Hey everybody, BrickLover18 here today, and in this video I'm going to be talking about how I'm going to rearrange the shelves here in my LEGO room. As you know, Christmas just happened, and I got a lot of really cool LEGO sets. Well, now it's time to take these new sets and adjust my current LEGO displays on my LEGO room shelves to like accommodate these new LEGO sets. So here on this shelf, this is like my favorite set shelf, the rare set, and kind of just on it I just put a lot of the, my favorite sets, my brick badge, exclusive sets, hard to find sets, these exclusive sets, and mocks, and just stuff like that, stuff that I really like that I want to keep on display, like at eye level at all times. This is going to be the main challenge right here, this set, just because I have all the boxes out, and I have my new, they're somewhere here, my new Clever 18 LEGO calendars that I'm going to hang right there just so I can kind of see the pictures and the date. So I'm going to pause the camera right now, do a little rearranging here, and I'm going to show you my update. So to kind of get a fresh start for the shelf, what I've done is I've cleared off everything that was in the shelf, or on the shelf, sorry, and put them in these bins. And then I just, that one set doesn't fit anywhere. So what I plan on doing, I'm going to move the leg room sign over to there where the poster used to be. Put the golden sprue that I just made a video on that's going to air later this week on. Put the hang that back up there. I'm going to put my new Brick Lover 18 calendars here. And then I'm just going to take like the rest of these sets and kind of make it look awesome. So I've started to put a lot more of my sets back on this shelf. And so far I think it looks really cool. Down here I have a lot of the LEGO Ideas set, my only LEGO Architecture set. I have some of my signs still pretty much in the same spot. My sprue is back where I wanted it. I have the two exclusive 2014, 2015 and 2014 sets here. The new Big Bang Theory set which is really cool. My two Bricktober sets that I do have, I can put them there. My BrickFed exclusive sets. My yellow play button, <laughs> my some exclusive cards, or not exclusive, but cool cards, piggy bank, and then just some other stuff here, you know, my safe, my birthday set, trophies, and my calendar. So I'm still working on how to arrange some more. I want to add the new studio set that I got from my Secret Santa haul, as well as I want to add this really cool spinning thing. As you can see, my whole leg room is pretty much a mess, but this shelf looks really nice, so that's all that matters. So here is the final shelf. As you can see, I have put a majority of the sets that I consider special and that I really like on this shelf now, and I'll give you a quick tour. Here I have my business card holder with some coasters, everybody else's business card that I have, this birthday cake, my BrickFet Toronto and Ottawa trophies, as well as these train containers, this art caddy it's called, the wheelchair, the safe, some small little mini builds, the piggy bank, I almost forgot my calendar, my yellow play button, all my pins, all my brick vet sets, another mini build, Bricktober, uh, Twin Towers, Golden Sprue, my Lego Studio set, and as soon as I build that, that'll go here, the Big Bang Theory set, the box, the pirate set, the White House, the Exosuit, my Brick Badge, the Research Institute, the Lego Movie Set, this Builder, Building in Progress thing from the Brick Builders Club, another Birthday Set, this Spaceman Set, and my Lego Room Sign. So as you can see, got quite a lot of really cool things, really cool sets on this shelf. And that's basically it. Thanks for watching this video where I kind of showed you the process of setting it all up and I hope you enjoyed and if you did enjoy it let me know by leaving a comment and a like on this video. Thanks everybody for watching and have a great day.